Not only has his game dazzled the world of golf since he turned pro in 2010, Matteo Manassero's demeanor on and off the course has won widespread appreciation and he's a worthy Wentworth champion. I'm really happy to come here all the time, but even more so being defending champion of uh, this, the flagship event of European Tour, the BWBJ Championship. It's really special and uh, I'm really looking forward to come back. His maiden victory at the Castillo Masters in 2010 was followed by further successes at the Maybank Malaysian Open and the Barclays Singapore Open before, at the age of 20, he became the youngest winner of the BMW PGA Championship. I've got a trophy in my, in my living room and, and I look at it and you know, my name is surrounded by, by these uh, this, this incredible names. I mean, the history of the game, really. But to join those names, Matteo had to dig deep. He began the final round, tied third with Scotsman Mark Warren, two shots adrift of leader Alejandro Canizares. Key moments, I would say, uh, very good birdie on number eight, uh, which is a tough hole. I hit a, it was a wedge, pin tucked on the left, I hit a good shot like to four feet and I made the putt. I was kind of struggling, couldn't find chances to make birdies. Uh, and after, after that birdie I hold the bunker shot on nine. But, so eight, nine was an important stretch for me. I would say those are the most important moments of the 18 holes. And they took him into a playoff against Warren, who was eliminated at the first extra hole, and the 2010 champion Simon Kahn, who two holes later found the water with his second shot to the par 5 18th, leaving the young Italian with a golden opportunity. You know, honestly, all you can ask for uh, in that situation. You know, I couldn't have less club and I couldn't have a better club. With the composure of a veteran, Matteo drilled a three-wood into the heart of the green and within reach of the most glamorous title of his career. We have two parts to win the BMW PGA Championship, so I was, um, I was still under a lot of pressure because it was still me to possibly screw it up, but I was also really happy. I mean, the smile was starting to come up in my face you know, because I was getting closer and closer and then but I managed, to, I managed to focus very well. Yes, with a tap-in, he became champion at only the fourth attempt and the second Italian to win after Costantino Rocca. I felt it as a team victory, really. As, as, as I, I wanted to celebrate it with the, with the people that were really close to me. My physio, my coach, my coach was actually here, um, was actually in Wentworth for that day, uh, and, and my family. You know, I, I really wanted to celebrate it with them because I thought it was a team effort to this win. It was also a triumph for Manacero over the critics who point to his lack of length off the tee. Following recent changes, the West Course now measures over 7,300 yards, so it's no pushover. I love the course. Uh, I mean, I, I, and, and the Saturday I was playing with Ernie, actually, uh, which is the main man of the changes. And, you know, uh, I've, 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 I've always been playing well here and I've always felt comfortable here. I mean, I, I might have this on my side that I've never played before it. Uh, I've never played before the changes, so I, this is Wentworth for me. Matteo last year rose to a career-high 11th in the race to Dubai, but 2014 has seen a change in equipment, just one top 10 on the European Tour, and without a win since that heady day at Wentworth last May. After the win at Wentworth, I had to move on, and I didn't have a great summer, I didn't have a great end of the year. Uh, but, you know, you, you just have to keep going and, and, and do what you think it it's, uh, needs to be done to improve your game. And right now I'm standing in, in a position which I feel that my game is, is better, even better than last year. So could there be a greater incentive for getting along to Wentworth this week? We don't think so.